Hi, my name's Maddie. I'm a vet tech here at the Animal Rescue League. Follow along on a day in my life. My days as a vet tech here are split between surgery and shelter, so today you're gonna follow along for what it's like on shelter side. Today we're gonna be starting our day off by working on our revaccination list. All of the animals in our care require us to keep them up to date on their vaccines just to keep the spread of diseases and illnesses to a minimum just like it's important for animals outside of our care in our community to stay up to date on their vaccines as well. We're gonna be moving on to our tech checks for the day. If a staff member sees anything concerning about an animal, whether it's behavioral or medical, they can enter a tech check and then a technician will go, take a look at that animal, do an assessment, and if that animal requires any further care, we'll give that to them. If not, we'll put our notes in saying that the animal's okay and we'll close the tech check out. We had a tech check entered for a litter of five kittens with diarrhea. Because it's a litter and they're all in the same cage, we're unsure which kitten is specifically having the diarrhea. So we collected a fecal sample here and we're gonna start running the fecal and we'll take you through the process. What we're gonna do is we're gonna put our fecosol in our fecalizer. We're gonna mush the poop around. Sounds gross, but that's what we have to do. Now that I mixed it all up, we're gonna make our meniscus, which is, you'll see right here, this little bubble that I formed take our cover slide and we're gonna drop that on and then I'm going to set a timer for 10 minutes we'll come back and put it under the microscope we finished examining the stool sample under the microscope and determined that the litter of five kittens has tapeworms now we're gonna go start treatment for them one two down hatch okay our afternoons consist of assisting our veterinarians with vet checks. Vet checks aren't just used for our shelter animals, they're also used for our animals in foster. These checks can include anything from a revaccination, to examining an animal with a possible injury, to running tests for underlying illnesses such as Pan-Lupra parvo, or even just examining an animal for a possible upper respiratory infection. That sums up our day in shelter. Before I go, I'll make sure that all animals are medicated for the night and that any animals that come in during this time are set up and are comfortable for the night. Then you guys get to come back tomorrow and spend a day with me in surgery. Yesterday you got to see what a day in shelter life was like, so today we're gonna take you on a day through surgery. Here we have Click. He is part of our Click Copy and Paste litter. We are here just weighing him this morning, getting an accurate weight before surgery, um, and he's gonna get neutered later on. 3.14, 13.5. Now that all of our animals are weighed for surgery, I'm over here setting up some vaccines that we may need later on while they're getting prepped. All good. We have Miles and Maui here. They have been sedated. So what we're gonna do next is um, give them vaccines, give them any post uh, pain medicine that they're gonna need, get them prepped for surgery. And then once they're prepped, we'll get them moved into the surgical suite and then they'll get neutered. As the animals come off the surgery table, they'll get placed on a heating pad. At that point, we will monitor their temperature, also check their palpebrals throughout the uh, time that they're on the heating pads. Once they wake up, we will place them back in their carriers. So I have Kool-Aid here who actually got up and walked on her own, still a little snoozy, but we're gonna put her back. Surgery is done for the day. We had a total of 29 clients today um, between spay and neuters. We're gonna spend the rest of the day breaking everything down. All the tables will get cleaned. All the animals, once they wake up, will go back to their carriers and we'll start prepping and do it all again tomorrow.